Hello! Welcome to another Design Spark unboxing video. My name is Camilla and today we are unboxing Blue Energy LP Evaluation Kit from ST Microelectronics. So if you haven't heard of Blue Energy LP family, uh, Blue Energy LP is ultra low power, fully programmable and also Bluetooth low energy version 5.2 certified uh, system on the chip that embeds to itself 32-bit uh, Cortex-M0 plus-based microcontroller as well as a radio on the same chip. So this is the one here. And uh, the benefit of having that configuration is that you, have, you can implement both your application and Bluetooth stack on the same core and it helps you to save on the cost and also help to um, yeah, your, your BOM, your bill of materials will be a lot less because you're basically combining two components into one. So Bluetooth Low Energy uh, version 5.2. It's the latest certification for Bluetooth Low Energy. And with this device specifically, you can achieve up to 2 megabits per second of data rate, but you can also implement some of the advanced um, features such as long-range communication, uh, advertising extension, get caching, and uh, much more. If we look at the some of the performance characteristics, Blue Energy LP allows us to achieve really good sensitivity levels at very low power consumption level. The device also supports 250 kilobytes of flash memory, 64 kilobytes of RAM memory, and offers extensive peripheral set. The Blue Energy LP series come in different packaging. So the one we have here is QFN 48, but there, there are other options um, that are available. When you order the board from us, you get it in a packaging like this. And the, the part number is 2096057. And the kit itself we will, will include um, the board with Blue Energy um, LP SOC on it and this is what the board looks from the top and this is from the bottom we'll um, go through the components individually in a minute and you also get um, antenna with SMP connector here and um, you will get a separate USB cable for debugging so starting with the Blue Energy LP SOC. Um, it's in this right corner here, and then next to it, you'll find two crystal oscillators. And then to the right of that, you will see the SMA connector for the antenna. On the left, you will find another microcontroller for debugging and programming, and then the, the LED next to it, the L4 is to show the status of um, debugging. There's a digital microphone and then there's an accelerometer and gyroscope and next to it is the pressure sensor. The, there are several connectors here so for uh, Arduino compatible connectors that you can use. There are several push buttons and reset button, um, two LEDs. This area here is for power management. Uh, and to power the board, you can either use the USB connector here, SN6, or um, alternatively, you can use the, the battery slot here. Uh, or if you solder, you can use um, this coin cell battery as well. Another thing we could try is connect this the board to our PC and download something called Blue Energy LP Navigator, which is which basically a software package that will host all of the demonstration applications. And it's very easy to download. I'm going to share my screen and show step by step what I've done. And um, we will try and download the very simple applications and see how everything works. And then you're free to explore more advanced um, application examples on your own. So yeah, let's get started. 
So basically what we're gonna do, we're gonna type blue energy LP and we go to the website, SD website and um, yeah, you'll see all of the information about the kit and all the relevant content. But what we need is, so let's go to tools and software. And if we come here, yeah, we see something called uh, Blue Energy LP Development Kit Software Package. So we click that. And uh, if you scroll down, you yeah you say get the latest you pr agree and then you put your details um and i already have it downloaded and installed so it's quite intuitive so you should be able to install it and uh, yeah the board is already connected to my pc and uh, what we can do is um, browse through this uh, navigator uh it supports blue energy lp and um, yeah and also there's a um, really good window here where uh, you can go through the components um yeah, all the pins all the like you can see everything in detail and then if we close that and if we go to the home page there are a couple of demo applications there's uh, basic examples uh, Bluetooth low energy applications. Um, one thing to note is I, I did scroll through the applications and um, for most of them you will need another board. So I guess because you are testing Bluetooth low energy, it makes sense to have no one but two boards. Um, and then you can sort of load um, code for each of them and um, it will be a bit more interesting. Uh, because I just have one board, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to this BLE sensor app because what I can do is I can use the board and then I can use my phone and the app uh, which is called B uh, SC BLE sensor and um, we can run an example uh, so we click release and then we do flash and run the board my board is already connected to the PC and it's flashing and once that's done, I'm gonna um, connect to the app on my uh, phone. So let's try run connecting our board to our BLE Sense SD BLE Sensor app. So if I press connect the device, and then Blue Energy LP. Now we can see the temperature and the pressure parameters. What we could also do is go and plot data. And then if we, for example, choose accelerometer and start plotting the data. And if we move our device a bit, we can see that this is being recorded so yeah, this shows how easy it is actually to load any of the code to the board. Uh, you literally can use this navigator to test out the first couple of applications. And then, um, yeah, as I said, probably having another board will make things a bit more interesting. Yeah, there's other applications for things like 2.4 gigahertz radio examples. There's um, some driver examples uh, and you can go through them on this navigator window. And I have um, opened the, the data brief for the software package. So before you even download anything, you can see what to expect. Bluetooth low energy technology nowadays is being implemented in so many different applications, starting with your like, home and wearable devices, healthcare, even industrial applications. And with um, this device from ST Microelectronics, you can implement those type of applications without sacrificing on things like cost, 
the speed of your data transfer or range of your communication. We at Design Spark truly believe this is a great um, evaluation kit to get your hands on and experiment. As always, we're gonna leave all of the relevant resources in the description below. If you have any questions, please reach out to us here or at Design Spark. And this was Camilla with you. I hope I'll see you um, again very soon. Thank you. Bye.